Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Dylan Thacker and welcome to the Fast Lane. We're here tonight with NASCAR Heat 3 Championship Mode Season for the Xfinity Series. We already did the Truck Series. We won at Daytona. There's our beautiful Thrustmaster Xfinity Chevrolet Camaro. Number 99, we've got K&M on board. Um, Advocare and GoDaddy. So it's going to be a, an interesting season with some oh. good sponsors. Here's the championship settings. AI difficulties custom. It's 100% difficulty, 13% race length. Tire, and fuel wa tire wear and fuel consumption is normal. Flags is all flags, strict yellows. Stages are three race stages. Quick qualify, full damage, no stability help, no custom setups, and automatic transmission. Let's go to Daytona for the... Triple Q Power Shares 300 at Daytona for the NASCAR Xfinity Series. I'm also here with Jeremiah Kennison, aka Reaper Reborn 77. Hello, Jefferson. Je oh, Jefferson's a fun track on this game. He's doing his career mode in the dirt cars right down there at Jefferson, the road course. It's an interesting track to run. It's fun. It's super, super fun. He hit, already hits a car. <laughs> just pulls out of the pits. Not even really a pit. Oh, did you see that? Side swap in, too. You don't have to use the brakes. Just let go of the throttle and turn it. Alright, so. Uh, we're going to run a balance setup. I'm going to qualify here at Daytona, get this beautiful Camaro on the racetrack. Excited for this season as well. Truck race was interesting. Um, had a last lap battle with Parker Kligerman in the lead, but we were able to come out on top. So what a wonderful way to start off the truck series season. Let's see if we can repeat the cycle and win here at Daytona in the Xfinity series. That'd be pretty cool. Um, I really, I'm in love with this paint scheme. The blue, the black, the white just goes really well with this car. Thrustmaster. Oh yeah. Try to put this thing in victory lane. Run the bottom near the yellow. Don't scrape it like that. Slow you down. But run the bottom of the racetrack and qualify and it restricts the plate tracks. Hopefully get a faster lap time. Here we go. Lap one. Very excited for the Daytona 500. I'm going to try and win that race. No promises about that, but we're going to try our best. I'm confident we can do it. If we can do it in the trucks, surely we can do it here and there. So, uh, it's going to be... What? 100. 100 on... 100 on every one. I, didn't, I thought it was 110 for, uh, um, well, heat 2 was 110. Watt flag here in qualifying, we're going to run a 49.86. And I don't think they got the Xfinity Arrow package on these. The new Xfinity Arrow package. Spoilers big and so is the spoiler. The spoiler is shorter, I think. Lengthwise, not good. Not what I'm talking about. The height of it. Because it only goes over to the uh, deck lid. It's only as big as the deck lid lines, as you can see there, the black line on the deck lid and the pin. Come off of turn four. We hit the uh, transition there between the apron and the flat part of the, the uh, banking and the flat part of the racetrack. Right, We're going to start P36. Oh no. Oh, that's scary. We're going to see who got pole here. Justin Allgaier gets pole. <laughs> Garrett Smithley on the front row. Wow. All right. Here we are at Daytona for the Triple Q Power Shares 350 at Daytona. Ross Chastain has an engine change, had an engine change after qualifying. He's going to start in the back. <sighs> Here we 
to go. We'll see what we can do in the Xfinity Series. Green flag is out. The, Q, the Triple Q Power Shares 300 at Daytona is underway for the NASCAR Xfinity Series. Three lap stages, except for the final stage. Drafting is going to play a big role here at Daytona. It always does. Always, oh, always makes for a very interesting race. Top line's getting one really good run off, off the corner there. Uh, we were able to block there. Hit Tom Ajeski pretty hard in the 60. Brandon Brown comes up. And I'm going to pass him. Joey Gase also comes up as I'm coming to the top. I think their lines changed. Too rapid. Two to go here in stage one. We're going to try and side draft Joey Gase. We're able to get by him. We're going to try and get by Majeski here once again. And he gave us room. Morgan Shepard and Chad Finch on there. I'm going to draft the Shepard. Side draft him a little bit. Try to get a draft off the three of Todd Dillon. Car there is on the outside. Perfect. Now we're going to have to get a good run off Austin Dillon off the corner here. See if we have time to drop low. We're going to shove Dillon. We're going to get up here with Henry. Three wide right here in front of me. And I'm not going to be the ballsy guy and make it four wide. Three wide here again. We're on the bottom. BJ McLeod. In front of me here, the 23rd, Earnhardt Jr. See if we can draft with Ryan Sieg here. Okay, maybe not about Matt Tift. Hey, we'll draft with Matt Tift. For the final lap in stage one. Let's try to hit P20. So we're going to draft with Sieg here. Now I'll call Custer. We're going to get P20. Nice May, yep, P20 driver. in stage one. Whew. All right, so we're not going to pit. Restarting on the top lane. That's my worst nightmare, as you driver. guys know already. Almost ready. But we're going to try and make it work. Green flag is out for stage two. I'm going to start buying Cole Custer here and try something interesting. Inside, inside, inside. I'm probably going to regret this once we hit turn one. Okay, Custer got a run. Never mind. Inside, inside. <laughs> right now we're on a bundle on the top lane. Um, at the moment, I don't know where to go. Just going to step here on the top, looks like. Push Cole Custer. Top lane starting to free up. Michael Lynette to the very top there. I don't know what he's doing up there. Come on, Custer. Two to go here in stage two. Have not moved up. At all, we're going to go three wide here. I'm not waiting. I'm going to draft a seed. Come on, seed. We gave him a big shove. We make contact. It's okay, we were able to gather it up. Car there is on the outside. Outside. Got one outside now. Clear all around. All right, here we go again. Stay low, stay low. Still there. Oh, Custer. All right, clear outside. Car outside. Hold your line here. Hold the wheel. Final lap here in stage two. White flag is in here. 
We're going to try and get by Tiff. We're going to succeed. We're going to try and get by Harvick. Harvick gives us a hole in the bottom. He's going to. We're going to draft with Nemechek. We're going to push John Hunter down the back stretch. Okay, now we're going to try and get by John Hunter for P13. Still there. Here we are, three wide for position at the line. P12 in stage two. Driving, stage we're going to be up on the top of it. Oh, God, we're going to be on the top again. Okay. Unless somebody hits. Yeah, we're okay. Well, we're on the top. Start P12 for the final stage, final stretch of the race. All right, you're coming to the green. Be ready. Green flags out for the final stage here at Daytona, starting with eight laps to go. No, I lied to you. Seven. Thanks, nope, I eight. I will drop. All right, taking the bottom. And Stephen Lott looks like we're going to get by Allgaier going into one. Careful, still there. Drafting with Tyler Reddick. Up to P8 right now. Got plenty of time to make up positions. Looks like Cat. That's not Cat's girl. Is that Ryan Priest? Yeah, because here's Christopher Bell. They have similar looking race cars. Got a good run off of Reddick coming down the back here. Hang tight there, driver. Hold this line here. Bottom lane is clear. You're going to be needed. All right, we're going to try and get by Reddick here. We're going to get a draft off of Jeff Green in the 93. Draw clear up top. Oh no, that's Benny Wheeler in the 01. That's a small team. We're up here on the top though, we're going to see if we can draft with Miller some more. Oh, contact with Jeff Green there. I'm going to cut Christopher Bell off there. Not going to let that happen. I want to try and take advantage on the back here, draft with Benny Miller. We push Still Ryan there. Truex to the lead in the turn three up to P2. Right, now you're clear. I'm going to try and get by Truex going down the front here. A little contact the there. Side by side high. for the lead here at Daytona. He's going to get a good run. Comes Jeff Green to the bottom. Oh, we're three wide for the lead. Here's Christopher Bell. Inside. Oh, we made contact with Ron Truex. We're going to slow down just a little bit here. We can't let that break our momentum or motivation. we got to get to the front. We're still at the P4. Alright, we're going to get a good run coming off the corner here. I'm going to go high. Still there. Side draft. Get a run with Truex right here. I'm gonna split it. Uh, I better not. Oh, cars blowing up behind me. Car blowing up behind us here. Not too bad, not too bad. Just maybe a tire rub or something, some kind of issue there for Casbarella in 61. All right, it's. Spicing up a little bit here. We got more cars coming into the picture. Stay high, stay high. Still there. I'm gonna push Truex here on the top. See if we can make anything happen. Hang tight there, driver. Hold this line here. Looks like we've got some. Drivers, Brandon Brown coming in. You stay up high here. Stay Spencer up high. Gallagher. There, driver. Hold this line here. Sorry about the watch in the background there. We've got four laps to go. Here. We can do stay this. We've got plenty of time. Still there. I'm 
Here we are, three wide again. Hold your line for me. Hold your line. Inside. Inside, inside. Parker might have to let Spencer Gallagher get by us there. Finally to the bottom because we cannot make anything happen with the top. Try the top one more time. We've got a good run. Gonna shove Jeff Green there. He's gonna get a good run. And Christopher Bell make contact there. Three laps to go here at Daytona. Can I make anything happen? Still there. I'm gonna shove Green into three. Stay all over his bumper here. Still there. We got more cars coming in. Contact again. Couple more turns. Two more. Two to go. Hold your line. You got one inside. Hold your line. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like being on the top. This is exactly why the top is the worst place to be. You can't make anything happen. All right. Stay high, stay high. Still there. Oh my God, I stopped drafting. The air was just not working there. Contact again. All right. Oh my gosh. Come on. Alright, to there. the bottom. Final lap here at Daytona. The white flag this time, it'll be a checkered flag next. Car there is on the outside. Outside. Uh, One more car to get there. by going down Clear the back high. here. To the bottom we go. Can we get the lead? Oh my gosh, I just did that. <laughs> Woo. Close the door. Clear sailing to the front right now, dude. Holy crap. I don't know what spot I was there taking the white flag, but we did it. P7 to first in a lap. Vinnie Miller to the bottom. We're going to win here at Daytona. Woo! What a comeback. What a comeback. I told you, once the draft starts kicking in, man, we turn into a rocket. I just had to get the bottom. The bottom was my only chance of getting up there. Another great way to start off the season. bigger than winning a truck race any day. Alright, uh, so we finished first. We were outside of the top 10 every time. P5 again and the point standing. Put a cool looking trophy to get. To be able to take that and uh, put that on our uh, homework and win this. So, by far the best race we've had that beats the truck race by a mile. P7 on the final lap, taking the white flag and went straight to the front. Man, the draft built up there. Tune in next time for Atlanta. 
Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a thumbs up. Subscribe. I appreciate each and every one of you for stopping by. And, uh, yeah. Be looking out for the Monster Energy Series Daytona 500. See you guys.